Hello, my name is Wendy Benson. Thanks so much for taking a moment to get to know me. I'm so excited for this opportunity. I'm from Erie, Pennsylvania. I have a specialty in elementary English language arts. I am Pennsylvania certified in L-Ed and special ed. I also have my library science certification. I am currently the middle school librarian in my district for grades six through eight and am the gifted coordinator for the building. I also have my master's coursework in reading education and am an experience online instructor since 2017. Here's a little bit more about me. I am familiar with quite a few different ed tech tools. Um, Google Education is what my district uses. I've used uh, Zoom class in, Screencastify, um, different game sites such as GimKit and Kahoot. I did attend my state's educational conference a couple of years ago. I use different um, editing software like WeVideo and Manicam and am available for you to tutor from 4 to 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'd like to roll right into my lesson now. Thank you again for this opportunity. Hello, boys and girls. Welcome back. Nice to see you. Thank you for stopping in for our tutoring session today. Beth, how are you? How is vacation? Oh, good. Andy, Janelle, welcome back. Glad you're feeling better, Andy. Today we're going to play a little game to review some character traits. Okay, characterization. Remember, we learned about this the other day and we're going to earn our stars and take turns responding when I pull your number. Okay, Beth, you can be one, Andy two, Janelle three, and let's say Mike. Hi, Mike, thanks for hopping in. That's okay, running a little late. <laughs> you can be number four. This game is I have who has, so I'm going to read the first one. I have the first card. Who has a character trait for a boy who often doesn't remember to bring his instrument, homework, or lunch to school. Okay, we remember how to play this game, but online you just need to click the card that you think goes with number two, and then we will move on. All right, let's see who's going to have a turn. Number, number, number one. Okay, who did we say was number one? Beth, Beth, you are number one. Which card do you think goes after my card? Hmm. Let me see. Oh, try again, try again. Yes, forgetful, very good, awesome. I'll send a trophy your way, very good. And let's see, can you read it? I have forgetful who has a character trait for a girl who carries a mirror everywhere and checks her appearance hourly. <gasps> mm, let's see. All right. Beth earned her star, and we need someone. <laughs> it's way up there. We need someone who can answer the next. She has forgetful who has checks her appearance hourly. Ooh, number two. Who was that? Janelle, you were number two. Okay. Can you drag your card? Checks your appearance hourly. Hmm. Vane is number three. Well done, Janelle. Here is your trophy. Bing! And you earned your star. Can you read it to us? I have Bane, who has a character trait for a boy who often sets lofty goals, such as reading Harry Potter every week until he finishes the series. You know I'm a librarian. I would like that kiddo. Let's see. Um, let's pick a star number four. Who's four? Mike, you're up. Mike, what do you think? Um, someone who reads a lot, lazy, wise, ambitious, loyal, or generous. Hmm. 
not going to be lazy. Somebody who reads all the time. Another word for ambitious would be like really uh, hardworking, very um, smart, I would say, yeah. High goals, lofty goals, yes, ambitious, good. We're going to drag that over. Go ahead, Mike, down to number four. Awesome, good job, trophy for you. All right, Mike is number four, so his star goes at number four. Good work, everyone. After we finish this game, I just want to show you what we have for the very end of our time together. All right, at the end of our time together, we would play Gim Kit. So I'm just going to skip ahead a little bit. And again, we're going to review those character traits. Let's work together here. We could also do breakout rooms and do it individually. We're gonna hop up and answer this question. Hmm. Motivated, motivated, ambitious, very good. <laughs> All right, so that's kind of how I would wrap up the lesson just to give you an idea of some different games I would use. Thank you again for this opportunity. I hope to hear from you all very soon. Thanks again. Bye.